Hey guys, Frax1006, aka Wondermutt here again. And um, actually, just wanted to show you guys how to set the uh, priority and the affinity for um, your uh, virtual machine or VMware uh, player if you're folding in a virtual machine. Um, the reason you'd want to do this is actually because um, if you don't, it's um, it won't set the priority to low, it'll be set to normal, and it'll really cause your system to lag. You'll have to close down your folding um, in order to do anything else on your system, um, or you'll have to go in and set the uh, priority and affinity uh, manually each time you want to uh, use the system. Now, what I've done, I went ahead and pulled up my task manager here, and as you can see, I don't really have much running right now. And what I mean by the priority and affinity is if we pick um, a program um, um, that's running, let's just say a Google tool, Toolbar, and you look at the priority, it'll be set to normal. Affinity is going to be what cores it's operating on or allowed to operate on. Um, I'm using a 2700K, so it's showing all eight threads as the, the core count. Um, so anyway, let's go ahead and back this out. And um, what we want to do is we actually want to make some changes to the uh, the actual um, virtual machine. And we need to do that through um, a text editor. So let's go ahead and pull up um, or navigate to your virtual machine. So mine is in my documents, virtual machines, and this is going to be folding one and you want to um, right click on your VMX file your VMX file if you hit properties you'll see it's a dot VMX um, right click on the VMX file and you're going to want to open it you'll see open with notepad um, I'll be using notepad plus plus it's just a uh, little bit different version of notepad alright and then this is going to be the actual code um, for your virtual machines, the configuration code. And what we want to do, we'll need to add a few lines in here. The first line, we'll need to add priority dot grabbed G-R-A-B-B-E-D space equals and then in parentheses we want to put idle, I-D-L-E. Okay. And then the next line down, we're going to use priority dot ungrabbed. That's a U N G R A B B E D space equals, and then in parentheses again, uh, the word idle. Okay. And then we'll need to set the uh, the affinity, which actual cores is the uh, virtual machine going to be folding on. So to do that, we're going to do processor zero dot use space equals and then in parentheses, oh, another space, I'm sorry. And then in parentheses, type true. And you'll do this for each um, physical core of your processor, not for each thread, but for each actual core. Um, now, if you're um, using a an AMD GPU and you need to leave a core open um, for the GPU to work on um, or you don't want to fold on all cores of your system what you would actually do is instead of putting true put false and I believe these do have to be in capital letters I haven't tried it in lowercase but I believe it does have to be in caps but anyway if you just put one of them as false um, that'll leave a core open uh, now, because this does work on the physical cores and not the threads, um, and it's actually going to leave two threads open if you're working on if you're using like a, a twenty-five or a yeah twenty-five or I'm sorry no a twenty-six hundred K or a twenty-seven hundred K. So anyway, um, I want to have this on all four of my um, cores, so I'm actually just going to copy these two lines go down here, paste them, and then we'll just change the numbers on them. This is going to be 2 and 3. And as you may have noticed, it always starts with uh, core 0. 
So if you have four cores, it's going to be core 0, 1, 2, 3, instead of 1, 2, 3, 4. So you always want to start with 0 on that. All right, so once we've got the, that uh, piece of code filled in there, let's go ahead and just hit Save. You can close out of your notepad and then go ahead and just double click on the virtual machine. And I'm running multiple monitors here, so it popped up on a, another monitor. And I'm just trying to get it. Ah, there we go. All right, so you see here my virtual machine is booting up. <clears throat> go ahead and close this folder. And I'm going to bring. There we go, my task manager back up. And just waiting for that VMware, there it is, VMware.exe, or VMware-VMX.exe. All right, you see my folding client has started there. And I'm gonna jump over to my performance. I'm gonna wait for this to max out, which will actually be once the client gets up and running. Should take just a few seconds there. Okay, here we go, and my client has finally started there, and you'll see my CPU usage is maxed out. If we go over to the processes, you see there's the, uh, the VMware workstation, and if we right-click on it and we look at that priority, you'll see that it's automatically been set to low. All right, well, guys, I uh, hope this video was helpful to you. And um, if you have any questions and need help with it, feel free to comment below or you can find me on overclock.net. Just do a search for Wonder Month. I should be the first and only user to pop up there. Um, thank you guys very much for watching. Like, subscribe, comment below. And um, thank you.